Hello, you are welcome. How to solve for x in this nice much problem? Here, yeah, let's use two methods. The first method from here, we make use of the W Lambert function. And in what we have here, we have x with curve minus x equals to 4. Now, from when we have n root of a, this is same thing as a raised to power 1 over n. When we apply this here, then we have minus x raised to power 1 over x now equals to 4. Then from here, to remove this 1 over x, you can multiply both power by x, then this power 2 by x, then here, this we multiply and x cancel x, then we have minus x equals to 4 raised to power x. That is from here, we can divide both sides by 4 raised to power x, so here we have 4 raised to power x, then divide by 4 raised to power x here. Then here, when this cancel out, we have 1 left. That is, here on this side, we can write this as minus x times 1 over 4 raised to power x. Now equals to 1. And also, when we have 1 over a raised to power n, we can write this as a raised to power minus n. That is, here we have minus x times 4 raised to power minus x equals to 1. And from here, we want to work towards using W function, which is W into A, exponent A, which gives us A. So here, we need to have exponent. And also, when we have exponent n and y, this is the same thing as y. So that means here, 4 can be written as exponent ln 4, so that's the same thing as 4. Then that means here we have minus x multiplied by exponent ln 4, then times minus x up there, then equals to 1. That is from here, we can equally write this as minus x multiplied by exponent minus x ln 4 equals to 1. And in applying the W function here, what we have here, the power and the coefficient here are equal. And what is different here is that ln 4 is here. So now we can make this to have ln 4 by multiplying through here by ln 4. Then this becomes minus x ln 4 then exponent minus ln 4, then equals to, also here we have ln 4. Now from here, we can introduce the W function. That is, here we have W function of minus x ln 4, then exponent minus x ln 4, then equals to W function of ln 4. That is, from here, this will be the same thing as minus x ln 4, which is equal to w into bracket. Here we can write this as ln 2 square. And from the law of logarithm, from power law, 2 can come to the back here. Then we have minus x ln 4, now equals to w function of. 2 ln 2. Then also recall that we can write 2 as exponent ln 2. And that is here we now have minus x ln 4 now equals to w function of here we have 2 now as exponent ln 2 then times ln 2. Then from here, this is the same thing as 
minus x eleven four equals to here yeah, we can write it as w into ln two exponent ln two. Then here yeah, the power and the coefficient are the same. It implies when we take the w function, it will mean minus x ln four now equals to ln two. Then also here yeah, we can write ln four here yeah, as ln two squared. So we have minus x ln2 square now equals to ln2 that is also applying the law of logarithm to come back here we have minus x then 2 that's minus 2x now then ln2 equals to ln2 and from here divide both side by ln2 from here this here we cancel out then here also cancel we have 1 then that means we have minus 2x equals to 1. Then when we divide both sides by minus 2, we have x now equals to minus 1 over 2. So here we have the value of x in this problem. So that's method 1. Then let's use another method here. From what is given here, which we can write as minus x raised to power 1 over x now equals to 4 here we can use change of variable and select 1 over x be equals to minus 1 then taking reciprocal on both sides it means x now equals to minus 1 over y and also here it implies that minus x when we multiply both sides by minus here will be 1 over y then it implies that here we can rewrite what we have and this will become minus x which is 1 over y now then this to power 1 over x which is minus y will then be equal to 4 that is here, 1 over y, same thing as y raised to power minus 1, then raised to power minus y equals to 4. That is from here, this power we multiply from the law of indices, a raised to power n, raised to power n, same thing as a raised to power n times n. So when this multiplies from here, minus times minus is plus. Then y times 1, that's y. So y raised to power y now equals to 4. Then also here we can write 4 as 2 squared. That is here we have y raised to power y equals to 2 raised to power 2. Then here from this we can conclude that y is equals to 2. And recall that x is equals to minus 1 over y then that means here x will now be equals to minus 1 over 2 which is same with what we have in the first method thank you for watching don't forget to text subscribe to my channel turn the notification bell on and see you in the next class bye